plastics, there has always been and will continue to be a strong future in plastics. Society has relied heavily on non-renewable plastics for decades, a low-cost fossil fuel that has been engineered to last forever. Yet many countries, even developed nations, struggle to create circular economies around non-renewable plastics, and the process of creating petroleum-derived polymers is simply not sustainable. It's finite. Biopolymers is nothing new. It's the development of plastics from biological materials, like plants. Cellophane was one of the first, and has been around just as long as many of the non-renewable polymers used today. Biopolymers can be derived from manufacturing waste, plant husk, stalks, and byproducts from biorefineries. The issue with traditional biopolymers is a limited production supply, limited conversion processes, and limited barrier and material properties that do not always meet the needs of today's products. But the world is changing rapidly, and new biomaterials are being discovered daily around the world. Hi, I'm Dr. Andrew Hurley, professor and founder of The Packaging School, and it is a privilege and honor to introduce Dr. Sandeep Kulkarni of Cool Earth Solutions as the professor of this course. Dr. Kulkarni is going to be your guide in navigating the topic of biopolymers from definitions, explanations, examples, and even common misconceptions of these materials. You'll also take away strategies to implement biopolymers into current packaging applications, and he's going to conclude on the future of plastics and society. So what are you waiting for? Let's start learning.